Good morning. I am Ejebet Fitori, the Executive Director of the Smart Networks and Services Joint Undertaking. It is my great pleasure to announce today the much anticipated results of the SNS third call for proposals, which we are revealing today here at the 5G Tecretory event in Riga. This is a major step in Europe's commitment towards leading 6G development on the global stage. It is also a milestone for the SNS joint undertaking, which reaches with this third round of funding more than 500 million euros of EU investment from Horizon Europe dedicated to future connectivity. Our vision goes beyond enhancing existing technologies. We aim to push the boundaries and shape the future of connectivity as a unique European effort based on cooperation between the public and private sides and with the strategic involvement of national governments. Our research efforts align with the EU's strategic policy priorities and strive to act on technology trends. While several of our projects build on the evolution of 5G, others explore a more revolutionary path for technology solutions to solve societal and industrial challenges. The 6G vision of the physical and digital worlds seamlessly intertwining in a sustainable and trusted way will require converging adjacent technologies from microelectronics to cloud edge computing and building entirely new 6G capabilities such as AI native networks, joint sensing and positioning, and the integration of terrestrial and non-terrestrial networks. The overwhelming number of responses received to our third call for proposals shows that there is a strong interest from a wide ecosystem of researchers, technology innovators, network operators, industrial sectors and SMEs. We have received 109 proposals from around 1,900 applicants spanning across 38 countries with requested grants reaching 863 million, seven times of our available budget. We have selected 16 promising projects that involve over 300 beneficiaries from 25 countries. 25% of the participants in our projects are SMEs, highlighting our commitment to fostering innovation at all levels. These projects focus on key technology areas such as cloud native architectures, wireless technologies, IoT, non-terrestrial networks, microelectronics, sustainability, artificial intelligence and cybersecurity, which are all essential components for strengthening, for strengthening Europe's digital sovereignty. By fostering competition and innovation, building EU capabilities and supporting large-scale trials, we are making sure that European technology and EU funding are accessible to all stakeholders, driving Europe's digital transformation. This third call builds on the solid foundations laid by already ongoing projects from our two previous call for proposals where we have already seen remarkable progress in beyond 5G advancements, exploratory 6G concepts, initial 6G experimental infrastructures, and innovative use cases, trials with vertical sectors. With these new 16 selected projects, we are expanding the SNS JU's portfolio to 79 projects in total. I am delighted to present the 16 outstanding projects selected through Call 3. These projects represent the next wave of 6G research and innovation. In the field of system architecture, we have Flacon 6G, which will bring the intelligent 6G network of networks vision to life, delivering a flexible, secure and open 6G architecture. And Unity 6G, 
which focuses on creating a highly sustainable and scalable AI native architecture to support the diverse requirements of 6G networks. For wireless communication technologies, 6G Leader will be advancing the physical and radio access network aspects of 6G, such as machine learning and powered algorithms and disaggregated, disaggregated radio access networks implementation. And Multiax is developing a fusion 6G radio access network system that will pioneer multi-sensor and multi-technology paradigms for sensing applications. Moving on to communication infrastructure technologies, we have Ambient 6G, which will introduce energy neutral devices that will power IoT systems, and Nexusware, which will develop a sustainable, multi-connected 3D network integrating radio and wireless optical technologies. On the security front, the MARA project will contribute a novel 6G security plane offering transparent, multi-domain security and privacy provisioning, whilst Extra 6G will establish a robust zero-trust security framework focusing on resilient, AI-driven and quantum-safe network and services. On AI, 6G DALI will deliver an end-to-end -end AI framework for 6G, integrating AI experimentation as a service, data anal analytics and storage. We are also very pleased to have international collaborations with Japan and South Korea, alongside our ongoing cooperation with the United States. 6G Mirai and 6G Aero will focus on AI-driven systems that bring reliability and flexibility to next-generation radio access networks. These international partnerships underscore our commitment to global cooperation in shaping 6G standards. When we look at large-scale trials and pilots, Amazing 6G will showcase 14 large-scale pilots across Europe in industries like healthcare, public safety and transport and 6G Versus will explore the frontiers of sustainable technology in five environmentally conscious vertical sectors. Sustainability and developing chips for 6G are two focus areas of our work program with dedicated lighthouse projects. Sustain 6G is our lighthouse to integrate environmental, societal and economic sustainability into future communications and vertical systems. This ensures that 6G aligns with Europe's Green Deal ambitions, shaping a sustainable future with, within planetary boundaries. Extreme 6G is our microelectronics lighthouse. It will establish and maintain an open platform to push forward 6G chip design, developing the chipsets that will power future 6G networks. We will also have a new coordination and support project, SNS Co-op, supporting and facilitating the activities of the SNS program. These projects reflect the breadth of Europe's innovation in 6G, driving forward key areas like sustainability, AI, security, and chip design. I want to extend my heartfelt congratulations to the winning projects. We are proud to support these initiatives as they pave the way for the future of European digital sovereignty. A special thank you goes out to the many dedicated, independent experts who carefully evaluated the numerous proposals, to the members of the SNSJU, the European Commission, and the 6G Industry Association, and also to the entire community for their incredible efforts. Your hard work reflects the strong interest in smart networks, services, 
and the future of European connectivity. I would also like to express my sincere gratitude to the SNSJU team, whose dedication has made all of this possible. Finally, I would like to thank all the participants of this panel, as well as the 5G Territory organizers, for a continued excellent collaboration. Wishing you interesting discussions and a successful event. Thank you.